Persephone, I am not a witch. I am a wise woman. Spare me! Welcome to Dover Castle. There's been a castle on this site for around 2,000 years. So imagine how many people have lived here during that time. How many people have died here during that time. Who knows what ghosts or evil spirits we may meet as we walk around on our tour. Now if you're feeling brave enough, follow me. Bring out your dead, victims of the great pestilence. Come and take your final ride upon the cart of death. So bring out your dead. Bring out your dead. Bring out your dead. Bring out your dead. These are the words you hope you hear. I am collector of the dead. The plague victim. The plague man's cart, you'll all take that final ride. Some say I do bury a decent, and others, well, they say I do rob the graves. For the teeth, for the hair, for all manner of valuables. Mine's an honest trade. If you don't mind the smell. Uh, be gone, be gone from this place, I say. Be gone. Some say that I'm blessed, and some say that I'm cursed. <laughs> Many years ago, <laughs> I was young and fresh and vibrant, just like you. <laughs> And then I was tried as a witch. They put me on a dunking stool, and if I lived, I was a witch. They pricked me with sharp needles, and if I bled, I was a witch. And if I died, then I was dead. <laughs> but I was not a witch. And then they pricked me up behind a wall. They bricked me up, oh gasp of horror. And as they put the last stone in, they laughed. I could hear them laughing. <laughs> and I didn't even hear the joke. <laughs> I could hardly move, I couldn't eat, I couldn't drink. And there they left me to rot till my flesh fell from me. And my hair began to drop out and my last breath left me. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. In the king's bedchamber here, people say that on many occasions they've seen the ghost of a female servant. No! What have I done? Oh, I was mixing a potion to rid us of the rats. They were everywhere. We were overrun. And my lady came in and asked me to fill a flask with brandy. Of course I did it straight away filled the flask and sent her on her way on her horse for she was off riding that morning and I came back to carry on mixing the poison and I realised what I'd done. Oh no. My lady, my lady! It was too late, she was gone. I prayed all day that she would come back. But she didn't. The horse came back on its own. And then I realised I had to tell the master what I'd done. Forgive me. No! I will never forgive you, not while ever there's breath in my body will I forgive you. You will hang by the neck until you're dead. And to hang by the neck is a dreadful way to die. And there would be no hangers-on for me. I knew there was no alternative but to take the same as my lady had taken. <laughs> 